Some of our neighbors are using this good weather to clean up from storms that damaged homes and businesses Friday night into Saturday morning. One of those tornadoes killed a man. News 19's Mariah Wiggs shows us how some folks in Danville are coming together to help. Severe storm to left Mother Nature keeping score in the city of Danville over the weekend. Extreme winds cost the local school their scoreboard and left a gas station without a wall. The National Weather Service confirmed an EF2 tornado touched down in Morgan County early Saturday. Its path began near Danville. The tornado damaged the awning over a walkway between Danville Middle and High School and brought down the scoreboard at the football field. Head coach Andre Williams says there's a team effort underway to clean up and make repairs. You know, just in process of trying to figure out what's, where, where we go from here and um, still getting calls and, and just trying to get together and try to get on the same page. These, these people are, are go-getters here. Yeah. They, they'll work hard to try to get our, our scoreboard back up. Down the street, repairs have been made after winds from the storm ripped off the front of the solar gas station. Homeowners on Glasscock Road are working to cut uprooted trees and clear out debris. All these people are trying to, you know, try to move forward, you know, and they, this is a, a tight knit community. Um, the damage that it did up the road here, um, it, a lot of people, I was out trying to help each other out and trying to help um, anyone that they could. In Danville, Mariah Wiggs, News 19. Coach Williams also tells us the Booster Club is working to apply for a grant that could help cover the funds for a new scoreboard.